Good morning, guys. Well, Saturday, last day of my four weeks with uh, NCG. Um, if I don't get promoted today, then um, getting let go. Now, I made a sale yesterday, so that means I have to make three sales today now in order to get promoted. Because <laughs> It's supposed to be four sales in six days in order to get promoted or a $600 uh, production a uh, week. I do not have either. So I either have to close three apps today or make a hundred and no, five hundred and eight dollars in production today. I'm pretty sure neither of them are happening. I might be able to get one sale at the most, but yeah, I think I'm done for. I, mean, I know for the past three, four weeks, I've been saying, I don't like this, I'm not having fun, I'm not enjoying this job at all, yada, 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 but you know, I'd be lying if I uh, said I never once uh, uh, thought of what it would be like if I actually did make it all the way. Um, but then I think about uh, everything that would... Uh, all the possibilities of what would happen had I uh, been able to continue. All the sacrifices I would have to make, all the friends I would lose, family that I would never see again. I have lost friends in the past because of lack of uh, contact and that's exactly what was going to happen with this job. I would lose my friends because of lack of contact. Pretty sure of it. And my girlfriend, if I can't spend any time with her at all, it's like feels like we would grow uh, farther and farther apart and I don't want that to happen so and I, th I think about them uh, yeah the, the possibility is there that I could um, uh, one day reach management uh, level be my own boss make my own uh, schedule Yada yada yada, whatever. But what I would uh, lose, I feel, outweighs any of the benefits I would gain from uh, staying with this job. And yeah, I don't think I can handle that at all. I mean, I applaud people who, um, uh, who are able to do that, but I can't. Well, uh, let's not think about that right now. Um, hey, it's uh, December 22nd, 2012, and uh, you know what? We're still here. It's one day after the 21st. Ha. Ha. We're still here. We're still alive. I mean, over the past uh, two years, though, um, I have entertained the uh, thought of what it would be like if the uh, this uh, the, the, the 
the whole December 21st, 2012 thing did actually happen. Well, I've actually entertained that thought. And, uh... Admittedly, I kind of banked on uh, that happening. I mean, I have... I mean, in the past, I have been kind of uh, suicidal in thought. But then over the years, Dying by my own hands and alone, not entirely too appealing. But dying with pretty much the entire um, uh, population over one catastrophic event. Something about that just seemed a little bit more appealing than suicide. Wow, this is a great conversation to start the day. Okay, how about this? Hey, the sun is uh, out today. Sky is, well, partly cloudy, but it's still a nice day. Um, uh, had, I made a close yesterday. Going back out into the field today to close another app. Um, then uh, later tonight, um, office Christmas party. So, got that to look forward to. And, um, yeah, after that, it'll be a long uh, holiday weekend. And also, uh, I, I was actually... Uh, I just uh, checked um, my email, not uh, I think yesterday or the day before, but um, one of the places that I had applied to, they finally got back to me, and uh, they would like to set up an interview for uh, the 27th, and seeing as it is very unlikely that I'll uh, be uh, remaining with NCG, I think I'm going to uh, confirm that uh, interview then, and uh, go, yeah, go for that interview on the 27th, and see what happens. Um, so yeah, there's that. A couple of other places that I had applied to emailed back saying that those positions were either canceled or filled so whatever at least I do have one interview potential interview lined up for next week because this was uh, this email was a couple of days ago so I probably really should I really should have uh, replied immediately but I wasn't sure certain whether I would still be with NCG or not by then. And since now I am 90% uh, certain that today's my last day, I think uh, when I get home I'll confirm it. Whew. Okay, anyway. Uh, time for work. Alright, so I just got back home from work about half an hour ago. Um, so, let's see, it was a good day, I guess. Uh, closed another app. Unfortunately, it wasn't three apps, so not getting promoted today or tonight, uh, which also means. Week four, and the week four still have not been promoted yet, so yeah, I guess I'm done. No one seemed to um, uh, say anything about it though, so uh, huh. if no one says anything about it, does that mean they for 
get that they're supposed to let me go if I did not uh, get promoted in four weeks. Hmm. No, I don't think that's going to be the case. Yeah, they're probably going to let me go. Hmm. I don't know. No one seems to uh, even um, uh, be thinking about it, so... This has me a little worried, actually. I mean, I know that it's a bad, it sounds pretty bad, but I was actually looking forward to uh, them pretty much uh, canning me. Uh, let's see. There's so many words to use uh, for this. Can, sack, let go. Well, whichever word that you decide to use, I was actually looking forward to it. So that, one, I could spend more time with the uh, job that actually gave me uh, the freedom to uh, make my own hours. Two, get to spend more time with Steampunk Studios. Uh, and um, uh, be an effective uh, head of videography for them. Three, looking forward to having more time to spend with my friends. Four, looking forward to having more time to spend with my girlfriend. Uh, five, having time, period, to go to other inter interviews. So, the fact that no one mentioned that this was the last day of my fourth week and I have not been promoted yet uh, has me a bit worried. Because I do not want to uh, be the one who says I quit. You know, I want to be the one who went down fighting so to speak. Uh, I mean, I want this to have been uh, the last day so I was like I go down closing sales not go down because I uh, quit. Anyway, uh, in about an hour I'll be heading out um, to the office Christmas party in New Haven so um, right now I'm just home relaxing a bit got to change up in a few um, yep and taking care of this so uh, I guess I should take care of today's useless facts then before I go Okay, so for today's useless facts, we have marriage. Here we go. According to the monogamy myth by Peggy Volgan, about 60% of men and 40% of women will have an affair at some point in their marriage. I wonder just how biased those numbers are. I mean, I, I suppose I'm, uh, it could be true. I don't know. But something about that just seems kind of biased and prejudiced, in fact. I don't know. Whoa. A couple gets divorced every 10 to 13 seconds. Oh, someone uh, divorced. Men in marriages are more likely to have good relationships with their children. 65% of young adults whose parents divorced had poor relationships with their fathers compared to 29% from non-divorced families. 
Okay. Wait. And this book was written by a woman. Again, I wonder just how biased uh, this chapter is. Statistically, married men earn 10 to 40 percent more financially than single men with similar education backgrounds and job experiences. Okay, why is it, are these facts all focusing on the man? Exchanging of rings is a tradition that harkens back to ancient Roman times. The roundness of the ring is to represent eternity, and the donning of the wedding bands signifies an eternal union. It was once believed that the vein of the ring finger on the left hand ran directly to the heart. Makes sense to me. Ah, oh, that's a nice idea. At a Hindu wedding, the bride's hands are painted with an intricate henna design, which often includes the initials of the groom. The couple is then to search for the initials on a wedding night, a wedding night, which is meant to encourage the bride and groom to relax and feel more at ease with one another. Okay, and that's it for today's useless facts. Uh, tomorrow we have. Sure, why not? McDonald's. Alright, and that does it for today, uh, I guess. So, see you guys tomorrow. Unless I have something else to share later on in the night. Whatever. Bye, for now, I guess. Um... Oh, I guess that makes, uh, I guess this means I'm one of those people who will have a hard time saying goodbye then, huh? You know, that must be it. I must be one of those people who have a hard time saying goodbye. Uh, I imagine if I uh, didn't have such a hard time with that, I would, uh, it would be much easier for me to quit a job, to say goodbye to the job. I guess I can't say goodbyes. I guess I'm not good with goodbyes. Huh. Oh, man. I'm all kinds of weird, I think. Well, anyway. See you guys tomorrow. Unless I think of something else to say.